Security Savings Bank out of Olathe is closed tonight. Good evening. I'm Mark Clegg. I'm Elizabeth Alex. The FDIC shut, uh, FDIC shut down all nine branches of the bank, saying the company ran out of money. Lisa Benson is live in the newsroom with the story. Lisa? Well, all Security Savings Banks in Kansas have closed, but the nine branches will reopen tomorrow morning as Simmons' first national bank. This year alone, 130 FDIC-insured banks have failed. The most recent, Security Savings Bank, based in Olathe, Kansas. So there's de deterioration there in their asset portfolio. Basically, they're not allowed to operate anymore. The FDIC informed employees and released a statement regarding the closing this evening. Simmons First National Bank will take over operations at all nine security savings banks in the state of Kansas. Tommy May is the CEO of Simmons Bank. Over the next three or four weeks, we'll be making the decisions. There obviously are going to be some duplications, but generally, generally speaking, I think that the majority of the associates are going to continue to be there to take care of the customers. May would not give any specific numbers regarding job losses, but said there will be some. However, customers should rest assured. The customers, again, continue to use their checking accounts. They continue to do business just like they always would. Uh, ultimately, they will be uh, rolled into Simmons First National Bank. For the customers, it is going to be transparent. They can uh, use their ATM card, their debit card, write checks. The bank will open as scheduled tomorrow morning, just with a different name. Now, customers with questions about the closing should call the FDIC at 1-800-537-4048. In the newsroom, Lisa Benson, NBC Action News.